In the first season of One Hour Limit Locked, we set ourselves the challenge to get a fire cape in 45 days while only being able to play for one hour a day. I went 36 minutes overtime on the last day, but we got our cape in the end. The thing is, that was only the warm up. Now, we're really about to start cooking. 60 days are on the clock, 175 quest points are on the menu, 8 council members are in need of a charming knight in shining armour, and I'm the idiot they're getting. Welcome to season 2 of One Hour Limit Locked, it's chef in season baby. Hello again everyone, we are getting straight on into day 9 here, no long intro today because I'm cutting it a little fine to the time that the servers go down for maintenance, so yeah. Do we want to do these? Yeah, fuck it, let's just finish off the current ones that we got. So yeah, no long intro because the servers are going down in an hour and 15 minutes. So. The goal for today is hopefully to get horror from the deep and the giant dwarf done don't know if we'll finish both of them the deeper we get into the season quests uh we're cracking out at a time you know they're a bit longer a bit more in depth things to do so we're not smashing out like five a day like we were early early on there is still some small quests to do but the rewards are not particularly significant for a lot of them so they'll get saved till later when we even need them for prerequisites or uh, if we just need more quest points at the end to get up to the final boss. Got bird houses to collect as soon as we finish here though and then I will be on to horror from the deep after that. Should be a relatively quick quest from what I remember. Burner is still horrible. Yeah it is update day folks. Today is the Valamore release. So. I figured I'd get up early, record this, edit it while the servers are down, publish it, and I can just spend the rest of the day of Valamor recording, uh, recording content on my Iron Man. Have a whole bunch of videos out in the, the next week or so. Uh, probably gonna have like two videos a day on average because one hour limit locked is still carrying on. We're not gonna be heading to Valamor on this series, not unless there happens to be some like quest xp rewards that are super nice and we'll replace some of the quests we're less bothered about in our list more than likely we won't be heading there so all right we're up to 26 cooking the burn rate was not good at all i'm gonna leave it there for now though i want to go get these bird houses up otherwise they won't finish in time for us to collect them may not anyway but okay here we, are. we should get some uh alks as well so our rune pouch, and we've already got the rest on, I believe. Didn't need that many dick side necklaces. <sighs> Should have brought a in ring as well, but it's okay. We can just stop at the bank on Fossil Island. 10.06. Okay, we should still have time to collect these in the last five minutes of the session. That's 50 minutes from now, exactly. So I guess that's the timer on Birdhouse is 50 minutes. Two nests. Three. Not bad. We'll oh, probably actually go in GE, aren't we? I don't know if we need anything for her from the deep. Bits and pieces. And another nest there, that's four. Not bad at all. Okay, so we want the bar crawl card. And we want a games necklace. Just gonna get all the stuff that I already have. I uh, only need one each of these to bit of money coming in, very nice. Got an air rune, a fire rune. Who buys single runes on the G? <laughs> People doing horror from the deep, I guess. How many still now? 60. Jeez. Okay, and a sword. Bronze sword. Uh, sword, 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 sword. Okay, fuck that. I'm just gonna tell you to uh, the center of town. Bar one. I just didn't want to accidentally use those runes or other than my staff, so I thought, uh, Bronze sword. Beautiful. Okay, we still didn't buy a games necklace. I'm just going to mini game teleport to LMS. I want a quick reset. We should probably get gear as well. Mage gear with ranged and melee weapon swaps for 
with a dagger off mother. Okay, we got our fire rune, our air rune. We've already got everything else. We want some gear. Don't know if we actually need... Oh yeah, we'll want our German staff for the lighthouse teleport. I think we've got everything else. Oh, we need other runes as well. Uh, I guess we take chaos, because I don't really want to buy deaths. And then we need a sim and a bow of some sort. Wow, we don't even have a bow. Okay. Okay, yeah, I'm just going to get 100 death runes and a magic shot, but I uh, don't know if I have any arrows. Nope. Okay. Pretty good to go, I think. Get stam and then energy and then head to the lighthouse. In fact, we can just go to the fairing here rather than teleporting to Ardy. Wait, what? I don't have the requirements. Oh, I haven't finished the back roll, that's why. Vial Smasher on as well, very nice. Okay, now we do need to go pack to the monastery. Not the monastery, the uh, lighthouse. All right, here we go. Oh, I need more water runes, I'm dumb. To cast the uh, Amore runes. We need more water on there. Okay, back to the Barbarian actually, of course. Okay, got the lighthouse key. Uh, I'm actually just gonna go GE rather than Ardy Cloak, because I need more runes. I don't know what happened to them. I'm sure I bought a bunch, but yeah, we've got a bunch of water runes. We don't have air runes though. There we go. And we've got the battle staff for the fire and the... She's got like a regular combat potion as well, but it's not good. All right, in the lighthouse. Fix the lighthouse into the basement. Please don't make me go, oh no, it's gonna make me go through that dialogue every time. I didn't mean to do that, I didn't mean to do that. Excellent. Hello Jossic mate, here to come. I think there's a baby one first, so you can kill with anything and then... I should have brought prayer, huh? Like prayer pots. I'm just gonna fill around my teleports for now while I'm in this uh, situation. I'm gonna alk between attacks as well. Ah, oh, my auto retaliate wasn't on, I did not realise. Okay, first one down. Right, air white, water blue, earth brown, fire red. Okay, so we're on air. I don't want my auto retaliate on now, do I? Is she not hitting me? No, she is. Uh, is that brown? No, melee went orange. Could be melee. Fire, that's not fire, is it? That's brown, that's brown. That's red. That's green. There she goes. All right, that is the quest. Very quick one. Just going to talk to my man. Uh, this is a Zamorok. Okay, War from the Deep completed. 49 magic, 40 strength. And we have ourselves a damage book. Should we see how much a uh, Zamor page set is? Unholy book page set. 45k, probably worth it. I'll leave that in there. All right, next up, we are on Giantist Dwarf. Okay, we need some fire making levels. Time to get to work. Where's our tinderbox? Logs of the regular variety. Oh no. I thought it was gonna be faster today, now we're level four. What is this? I did not leave anywhere near enough room for a full row. I think we're like, one more invent after this to get the 16. I did the math yesterday. Maybe just over. Okay, I'm just gonna grab a couple of these ashes because I believe I had uh, Shades of Mortal not on my list, so makes sense. We may need them later. Even if we don't uh, need them for Shades of Mortal because I can't remember exactly, but you use them to make the potion. Any ashes we get could be used for herb law trading after that. A relatively cheap and quick with the Serum 207s. No profit margin, but you don't really need one. There's no combine in this quest, is there? Okay, so we can bank all our combat gear. On no way, and one tile that space are. Uh, F. There's 15. Okay, I'm actually just gonna do regular ones because we've only got a few works left, and I want them for the birdhouses. Not sure what level we're at right now. 23, we're only one level away from Willow, so it's not bad at all on the birdhouse front. In fact, we can probably do them on the very next one. We're two actions away from Oak, so we can take Willow on the next one. I'll get some Willow logs, assuming we can craft those, but I'm pretty sure we can. Yeah. Okay, so we'll get like 30. 
And we're going to buy all the required items. And I'm gonna leave the unrequired ones. And just get them as we do them. Because it's a pain in the ass. But it's a proper pain in the ass. I hate this quest. But it's got quite a nice spread of rewards across a few different... Oh, that was where my air runes were. I did have air runes. I'm just stupid as shit. They were in my pouch. Okay, so we don't really need any of this gear. I'm just going to dump it there and get a wealth glory jeweling ring out. Don't have a backup wealth. Going to get a few because we'll probably need them if our plan is to come back and forth here. Hopefully the other one's by. If not, we're in a bit of trouble. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Get the ball staff on. Okay, get the ring of wealth on. Do we need a tinder box? Coinage. Get some coinage. Get alk stack. There's the ring of wealths. And we're going to get some more alks. If we can. Uh, okay, do we have things to sell? We've got some bird's nests. Not all of them, not just one. Poison Crown ones aren't going to sell for shit, aren't they? You can't even note them. That's crazy. Are they not even tradable? Okay. I think we're just going to have to leave that there and get out of here because I'm wasting too much time, it feels. Okay, so we want an RD cape and we want our uh, Draymon. I don't know if it, I feel like I've done a lot of, I don't know how to describe it, Dwibbling around today. I don't know. Maybe I haven't, but fell a bit all over the place. Just over half an hour. Just under half an hour, sorry, to go. And there's the system war war update warning just popping up. 45 minutes. So yeah, I got, I got 20 minutes extra after we're finished before the update happens. All right, get ready for some long cutscenes in this quest, y'all. This is definitely not going to get finished today. I just remembered how long the cutscenes are as well. Oh, Jesus, this is dull. Why would they think this is a good idea? So we got our cooking up to 26. Fire making up to 16. Mine still at 39. I'm just updating my spreadsheet while this fucking cutscene's playing because there's nothing better to do. 40 agility and strength each. Very nice. 49 magic, so we can now enchant our own ruby necklaces without a boost. And 35 crafting is an extra level there. I think it was just from birdhouses. Alright, there's the cutscene done. Tell this guy that we'll fix everything. Boom. Now I've access to Keldegrim. And now we have to run all around it getting shit. The worst bit is the, the consortium, which is like the last step. We'll probably get up that far at least. But it can take the piss to get through that, so I'm not hopeful for completion today. Sound like my ex. I make a lot of jokes about my ex, but like I'd never have a specific ex in mind when I say that. I just think it's funny. If any of my exes are watching this, I didn't mean you, don't worry about it. Where's the librarian? Other side of the fucking world. It's a classic RuneScape quest, isn't it? You gotta run around and talk to a bunch of people, and you have to go back and forth and back and forth because Jagex hates us. I hate questing! Why did I pick a series on questing? It's okay. It's worth it for the juicy, juicy reward of those gloves to go with the juicy, juicy cape that we're not even wearing right now. Not this one, the far one. Who's hyped for Valamore? I am super hyped for Valamore. I have no idea what I'm gonna do first. Talk to who now? Oh, my man over there. Okay. Funny, perhaps you should improve your fire making skill. No way. First we failed to burn the actual logs. Now we're failing to set this thing on fire. I didn't even know this was possible. Hey, we got it. Third time lucky. Wait, what's that? Quizmaster? I mean, that could get us something, I guess. Very easy. We don't get many random events, so it's nice to do them when we have an opportunity. Hopefully it's not just a spinach roll. Because you have to go for the mystery box, it's not even a question. Here we go! Oh, we got a loop half. It's actually not bad, that's like 10k, that was worth our time! Very nice, very nice. Oh, is this the cunt we got a telegram from? Because he's just an arsewipe. Thank you very much. Oh, right here. Okay, so we go down to Mod Skipper now. Cheers, AIQ. Can we wear these? I really want just like a really bad fitting outfit in the game. Like, I think it'd be really cool if they made like a crafting minigame in Dogish Khan, where you could get a crafting outfit. You know, like the other skill XP boost outfits. 
Uh, and just have like a, a Dorgish Khan goblin outfit that's just really poor fitting on the, on the player models. I think it'd be hilarious. Just like some tiny tight short shorts or whatever and a dumb helmet. Oh, nice. I got a teleport back there. Fuck! Just magically teleported. I'm not complaining, it saved me a lot of time. Oh wow, we're at the consortium bit. Well, if we just pray for some lucky tasks. I think I'm gonna do this one because it's closest to uh, the minecarts. What, wait, what was the task? I didn't see shit. Five pieces of myth. Now we'll buy ten. Okay, and then we'll unnote it and get back over there. We're gonna do a whole bunch of these orders, so please tell me we can use this. Please tell me we can use this. Can't minecart with a follower. That's weird. Okay, here come your five myths. Uh, four pieces of copper or Oh, he's changing. Okay, well, can you get myth? Because I have myth. Iron. I'll just... I'll take that. Iron or Copper or Clay. I know we need some of that sometimes. I'm just getting all sorts of shit here. It's all relatively cheap, so... Oh, I'm gonna have to put Scurry away again. Maybe I should uh, just keep him in my invent for now. Thought try alking on minecart, see if it worked. Oh shit, I didn't uh, unnote them. Okay, uh, it's over here. Oh, I'm actually on a blast furnace. Well, that's crazy. Uh, what did we need? Iron? I feel like it was the iron. Just grab a load of random shit. In case he happens to ask for it next. Did it have to do a whole bunch of these? There's like two whole phases of it, so. Next task Gold ore. No thanks. Oh my god, he just keeps asking for gold. Myth! I can do that right now. Silver. Come on, give me iron. Copper. Copper. I've got those. They're in the bank. We can do that. Oh, that guy just door fucked me. Okay, I'm actually just gonna deposit some shite. Uh, what did we want? Copper? I'll get the iron as well. Grab a few gold, because he wanted some of that as well. So he might ask for it again. We need stamp. Three pieces of copper. Got it in my invent, mate. Need to speak to the director. Oh! I didn't see what the task was. Bars of steel, how many? I didn't see. Oh my gosh. Okay, my cash stack is like non-existent at the minute because I'm just spending it on all this random shit, but hopefully we don't actually, like we'll be able to sell some of this back, so. Okay, so we need the steel bars. Let's go. I think we're on the direct now, so. Oh no, I went the wrong way. Wait, oh my God, that was actually the last one. Uh, are we done? Oh my god, I actually got it done today. Oh, I should have stayed up there and gone across, but... Holy shit. That was a lot quicker than I remember. That being said, come to think of it, the last time I did this, probably the only time I did this was on an Iron Man. So, <laughs> that makes sense why I hated it a lot more. Can just go to the GE and buy everything here. I do not want to attend. I do not have time to waste. There we go, look at all that beautiful XP coming in. Oh, that's so nice. I am going to head on over to the Ferox Enclave for a reset real quick. Bunch of levels flying in there. We can start Watchtower now. I believe we've got some birdhouses to collect though, so I'm going to go do those first. Okay. So I'm not going to be able to put this birdhouse down until I've collected both of these because I need both to get the next level. So I'm gonna have to get that one, get that one, and then place it. Then we can go put the other one down as well. Beautiful. Okay, that's another birdhouse run finished. We will go to the Grand Exchange and see if there's anything we need to buy up for Watchtower and get rid of all the shit that we just invested in that we don't actually need. I think that might be all of it. Okay, just put it all in at whatever price basically. I do need to make a bit more space though. Okay, and then what do we need for this quest? We need a Guam potion. We need Jango berries, dragon bones, bat bones, and a gold bar. Are you serious? I just sold two. What a fucking idiot. Okay, I think we've got everything for that quest. Ah, uh, other than the bat bones. Yeah, and that is gonna be about it for today. Pretty decent day, all being said. Pretty decent. Just delete some of this shit. 
Yeah, uh, we we got both the quests done what we wanted to do, which is good. I wasn't sure if we were going to about halfway through the day. It wasn't looking good, but that second part of the giant dwarf really was nowhere near as bad as I remember it on the Iron Man. So, it makes sense. We got some cooking levels up as well, and some hunter levels, of course, with the birdhouses. We got a whole ton of different little bits of XP drops and different skills from the giant dwarf. Fire making now up to 19. Uh, the mining is at 40, so we can start the watchtower now like we wanted, and we got a couple of smithing levels as well there. What else did we get from that? Crafting, thieving, fire making, magic, smithing. Mining. Decent bit there, a bit of thieving as well. No, we've had a pretty good day. I don't think we hit a magic level today. I'm not sure. We must. We must have. Yeah, I feel like we must have. Because we did Horror on the Deep and that got a decent bit of magic. We also got the strength level there. Been a decent day. How's the cash stack looking at the minute? 152k? It's not too bad. It's like pretty much just breaking even. If we break even and we always have around this amount of cash to spend, I'm fine with that. It's perfect. That's sort of what I wanted from the birdhouses is just to help me sustain through all the questing that I'm doing. Yeah, solid, solid day. We've got more birdhouses to do tomorrow. We can pick those up. Move on to the watchtower and... Not entirely sure after that. Maybe I'll go for one of the council members. We'll see. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please do leave a like. It helps out a ton, pushes the channel into the algorithm, and lets me know that you enjoy what I'm creating. Make sure to subscribe to the channel as well. Plenty more one-hour limit locks on the way in this season. And like I mentioned earlier, I'm going to have a shit ton of Valamore content coming out. I'm pretty sure I'll have guides for everything in Valamore that I am capable of doing. I don't know if I'm going to be capable of Colosseum yet. We'll find out in a couple hours. Perilous Moons, though, I'm really excited to dive into. I'm sure we'll get some questing videos as well. No idea what, what content I'm going to get, but I'm just going to turn the camera on for the rest of the day once it's out and, and just chill. So yeah, my uh, my hope is to get this video out for you all before then, so I can log in and enjoy it for the rest of the day. And let me know if you're excited for Valmore as well in the comments. Let's get some hype, because I'm super hyped for it. That, though, will be at the end of today. Until next time, look after yourself. Be lovely to one another and I will see you on the next one.